30 minutes and four seconds late. We stopped serving breakfast at 10.30. Oh, oh no. <laughs> no, no, no. Don't cry. I'm sorry. I wasn't cursing at you. I was cursing at the lady. At the lady. We'll get you one of those happy oh. meals. Can we get a happy meal? Can we get a happy meal? Will somebody get you a happy meal? <laughs> Hey everybody and welcome back to another video if you're new here i'm mary and today i'm going to be watching another adam sandler comedy classic big daddy released in 1999 directed by dennis dugan who also directed happy gilmore i reacted to that maybe like a month or two ago so if you haven't seen that video yet go ahead and check it out i hope that it's just as funny as Happy Gilmore. I had such a good time watching that movie. The blurb here reminds me of some sort of social experiment a crazy YouTuber would do just to bring their numbers up for their videos. A lazy law school grad adopts a kid to impress his girlfriend, but everything doesn't go according to plan and he becomes an unlikely foster father. Sounds like a crazy social experiment, but it also just sounds hilarious and ridiculous to me, as is the nature of Adam Sandler comedy movies. I mean, look, as I said in my Happy Gilmore reaction video, his movies are sort of hit and misses. I've seen a few of his movies. I've watched Billy Madison a few times. I've watched 50 First Dates. I've watched Click, but I cannot remember what the hell goes on in that movie. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I've watched the murder mystery movie that has come out on Netflix, the first and the second one. A lot of his comedies are hit and misses. I know the earlier comedies are more hits than they are misses, but regardless, a lot of people really love this movie. So I'm very keen to check it out before before we do, I want to remind you guys about the uncut version on Patreon. If you guys want to support me, you can do so by checking out the uncut reaction to this video. And basically what that means is you can watch the movie along with me. You just need a copy of the film so that you can watch it along with me. There will be a timer. I can be on one screen and the movie can be on another screen. There is also a library of movies that we can watch along together as well as early access bloopers, behind the scenes polls, all of that good stuff. And down below, you can also find all my social media handles, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch, Discord, TikTok, Facebook, as well as my two other channels, my gaming channel, Cherry Plays, and my vlog channel, Very Cherry. So guys, with all of that said, let's get watching. Oh yeah, okay, dad, I act like I'm sick. <laughs> <laughs> Milk running down his chin. I'm not a kid. All the money I won from the cab accident is kicking ass in the oh. stock market, so relax. He won money? I want to know more about this you're cab accident. Something. You're the lawyer in the family. I ain't taking a damn bar exam. I got too much other shit going on in my life. What? I want to know what know other what sh he's talking about. <gasps> I gotta, I gotta go. Oh no, is she okay? This is a rough patch of my life right now, all right? Syracuse is 0-3. That's a rough patch? And a jury decided that one night of pain was worth two hundred thousand dollars damn it's a lot of money what do you need a father figure stop pulling your sister's hair <laughs> you know what? I need to go to Sarah's. i'll be back on wednesday she looks great very professional oh i know this guy what do i need to think about your life and why there's any reason for me to be a part of it Ooh. Damn! while you're at it why don't you think about getting a real job? Ouch, she's given him an ultimatum. Patrick Ewing, nice job. Okay, so this is his job. I mean, at least he has a job. Where are you going? Manhattan. Manhattan, you want to take me with you? Yes. What? Actually? All right, I guess we're going to New York. No wonder he adopts a kid. Because she's ready to start a family. Surprise! Oh. Him. Oh. Oh. Surprise. Surprise. Oh. Surprise. oh, that's sad. We wasted the good surprise on you. Damn, she's acting like a baby. I've been sleeping in the office. We're going to trial on the securities fraud case. Wow, so his friends are successful. The girl from Chase and Amy. Maybe you can try suing under the Foreign Corrupt Practices Act. I hey. Back to the office. Sonny, you're the king, right? Hey. Maybe. See, if he just used his head and focused on his bar exam. Oh. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> They're like brothers to his bag in school. They're still like our brothers. Our very, very gay brothers. <laughs> Hey, that's very progressive of Adam Sandler's character. Well, you're not gonna let a little rain stop you from making a hundred hamburgers, are you? It's like she's talking to a baby. 
doing this, yeah, how? Hmm? <laughs> uh, tomorrow I'm leaving for oh. China. Oh. Represent... Yes, me, the same guy who once shaved his ass to win a $5 bet. Prove it! <laughs> Show your app. <laughs> I'm about to do something that I never thought I'd have. Oh, I reckon to. he's going to propose. You're not proposing, are you? That's what I thought. Why did he have to say it out uh, loud, though? He was not. literally talking crap about his relationship like two seconds before. Anyway, uh, will you? He ruined this as well. Good call in two weeks, pal. <laughs> you really got that wrong. Congratulations, you and Big Boobs McGee are going to be real Big happy. Boobs oh, McGee? I want to explain to your children you met their mother while she was waitressing at Hooters. Who cares? Seriously, from now on, Dr. Big Boobs McGee. From now on, demand respect. I a career, stable relationship, family. Mm -hmm. That's how they get. Those That's how people ladies. get. Yes, that was nice. Nobody was asking <laughs> you to get a job. Tommy and Phil were showering separately. <laughs> Tommy and <Okay>. Phil. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Not. Oh. That can't be good. That is not a good omen. You guys should sit around and talk about who's hangs out of their shorts the most. He's pretty rude. He gave me $5 to bring him over here. What do you mean? Later. What? So that's how the adoption happens? Dropped off at somebody's door? Oh, he's so cute. He's got the cutest little yeah, face. Dude. Dear Kevin, this is Julian, your son. That is scary. Who's this? Uh oh. It's my friend. <laughs> is that Kevin on the phone? Is he alright? Yeah, he just doesn't like you. Leave us alone. You're such a. He really is. Really Jan. Jan. I don't know any Jan. What? Are you kidding? Come on, is there really a kid there, or is this like the time you told me my parents were dead? What kind of I'm prank is home. that? Right, your parents are dead. I found a foster family that. Yes, Uncle Remus. <laughs> I know the catfish are huge. He's a good liar. You want to come and sit down, pal? He looks homeless. Social service office is closed today, Columbus Day. We'll be open tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. Uh, it's going to be a while before they can reach the social car. services. Maybe He's going to have to sleep over a stranger's house. What do you eat? Food. Food. What? Come on. Oh, that's so cute. What I like to do on Monday afternoons is go to Central Park and watch the rollerbladers fall down. You into that? What kind of life is that? I don't feel like I'm wasting my life doing that. How old are you, anyways? Five. Five? Oh, he's five. You can wipe your own ass, huh? Yes. Good job. <laughs> so he's going to make him purposely fall. That is criminal. That's criminal. What a jerk. I wipe my own ass. Or, uh, what's this guy's name? Scuba Steve. Scuba oh, Steve. Well, my cat, he bite his head off. What kind of cat would do that? You calling me a liar? <laughs> hey, take it easy. Anyways, just a kid. What are you doing in here, cutie? <laughs> Watching football. Oh. What do you want to win? The goddamn Jets. <laughs> He's like a parrot. <laughs> I'm dusty. Dusty. Everybody's so busy with their crap lately, no one ever comes. Oh, like, yeah. Um, not bring it on, woman. <laughs> Crazy old man. He drinks a lot of soda. <laughs> yeah, he does. His teeth are rotten. Enjoy the metabolism while you got it. Metabolism? Metabolism? <laughs> I had fun today. Did you have fun? No. Yeah, you're all right. Because it's a nightlight. When he came to the door, he looked like he was homeless. I guess there are lights out on the streets. Make it less scarier for him. Oh my god. Live nudes. Really? Are you my dad? Ooh. If a kid like that asked me if I was its mom and it was that cute, I'd be like, yes, <laughs> let me adopt you. Kid is so cute. I wonder if he's the same kid from... I don't know, he's just, he's very familiar. Cleaning it and toilet training it. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is kind of like that, except with a human. So it's more I mean, difficult. Glad, since sometimes women get pregnant to try to fix a troubled relationship, <laughs> why can't a guy adopt a kid to do the same thing? Well, yes, I don't think this I'm is a good idea at all. You're right. Can I borrow your cell phone for a minute? Are you going to call Vanessa? Oh. I don't know who this bloke is. Yeah, I was wondering, you still got a foster family lined up for Julian. Well, you can cancel him. I, I decided to take care of the little guy. What? Hey, you two want to get married? I support that. Leave me alone. <laughs> Natural parents take the responsibility. I mean, there's absolutely no bigger high for us. That's so I guess that seems so easy. Yep, that's it. And good luck what? to you and your son. That's way too easy. No, nah, that's way too easy. <gasps> no, no, no. Sonny is not a good influence on this kid. 
wonder if it's because he had a nightmare. Oh, God. Ooh. That's a load of <laughs> load of That's funny. Don't you want to remove the sheet? No more wetness. Uh, that's All not right. very comfortable. Stay asleep. Stay asleep. I guess he'll remove the sheets when he wakes up for the day. rustling oh so uncomfortable oh. sit still why don't you set him up on the couch or something <laughs> all right i'm up <laughs> what are you doing there, damn that's boy? a lot of cereal 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 how do you trust him to pour a bowl <gasps> oh my god we can fix this oh poor kid not a big deal so much newspaper lying around. Don't worry about it, boy. Don't worry about it, boy. <laughs> Scooby Steve, damn you! He pranked him. You, like you think that's funny, me getting hurt? <laughs> oh, we can catch McDonald's breakfast. I haven't been up in time for that in like ten years. You want to do that? Wow, ten years of not can waking up that? before eleven. What are you doing? Oh yeah, Aww. the handholding thing. <laughs> the hand-holding thing. I remember my dad took us to McDonald's the very first morning they had breakfast. Oh, was wow. What the hell is that? To go to the bathroom. You what? We, you, you, we're going to be there in a minute. They're going to be late. Hey, didn't you pee enough in bed already? No, oh you didn't. Hey, buddy, can my kid use the bathroom for a minute? It's not my problem. <laughs> Rude. <gasps> oh, nice. What? All right, we're gonna miss breakfast. Let's go. Put it away. Put it away. Hey, thanks anyways. Your thing. Thanks anyways. <laughs> it's, it's on your restaurant anyway. Hey, mister. Why are you sitting on the ground? Well. Why? They made some really bad choices after high school. Why? Why everything? If you end the conversation, I'll get you an Egg McMuffin. Hey, look, look, look. What the you fell hell? asleep. You fell asleep. Let's go. <laughs> He fell asleep. That was so instant. What? Sausage, McMuffin. That was so weird. Why did he do that? Oh, that was his way of ending the conversation. Right. Sorry, sir. We stopped serving breakfast. Oh. Four thirty minutes and four seconds late. We stopped serving breakfast at ten thirty. Oh no. No, no, no. Don't cry. I'm sorry. I wasn't cursing at you. I was cursing at the lady. At the lady. We'll get you one of those happy meals. Oh. Can we get a happy meal? Can we get a happy meal? Will somebody get the kid a happy meal? <laughs> Hey, what, what, what's my egg McMuffin? Breakfast is over at 10.30. Oh. Really? Yeah. I thought it was 11. I thought that too. Should have got him something else. You're going to meet Vanessa tonight. She's nice. You'll like her. The way he cries is Once so funny. Well, <laughs> oh. What the heck? Oh, he picked on him. Oh, that's fun. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? You like hockey? Like hockey? Oh, I remember playing this as a kid. How oh man, wood wood kids. Chuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood. <laughs> yeah, oh. that's what I thought. Shut up. <laughs> Got him. You want some food? Whoa. He is not a good parent. Kids passed out from a sugar rush. <laughs> Quiet as a mouse. <laughs> Calm down, dude. But after my nap, I always watch the kangaroo song. The kangaroo song. Kangaroo! Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> oh. Is this an American kid or an Australian kid? What happened there? You all hopped out? Oh, good God. Just an endless supply of newspaper. Oh, that is nasty. You don't have to pee, do you? No. You swear? I swear. I swear. Only you and my grandfather go every 30 <laughs> seconds. Let's hurry it up. This kid really does pee a lot. I'm telling you about, man. She's going to be a big part of your life. If she agrees. Julian? Julian? Hello, Julian? Hey, Sonny, I'm right here. Oh, <laughs> so precious. Still, why here? <laughs> so freaking cute. Just because I don't have a job.
job doesn't mean I don't want to move on to the next level. Oh my you gosh. Before you took his sunglasses off. He wants you to see him. That means he likes you. Oh. Come here, pal. Vanessa. I don't think Vanessa's receptive to this. Our son, I adopted him. I don't know what to say. You I'd be like, get him. out of here. This is a prank. Uh, somebody in the bathroom? Why is the door shut? Why would she invite Sonny when she has somebody else here at home? Is who's, everything okay? Oh who's this? God. Hey, Sid, I had an attack. Oh, no. Paranoia. I thought you were sleeping with my girl. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, he put his glasses on. That's what I was trying to tell you before. I found some. This what guy? the hell? Sid has a five year plan. What is it? Don't die? Don't die. I, I did this for you. You wanted me to be more responsible. This has backfired so badly. You know, you remind me of my oldest grandson. Hey, old man River, zip it or I'll break your hip. <laughs> you know, deep down, you must have known this day was going to come. She hey. basically cheated on him. Body on top of you with his loose skin and old. Ew. Old, Stop. Old. He's right there. But also, she shouldn't have cheated. What the hell is going on? You can't just leave someone like that. Got an emergency problem with this kid here. Is Arthur Brooks around? Yeah, I'll go get him. Is he yeah, go trying to give the kid yeah. back? I had a mother lined up for him, but she's banging the Pepperidge Farm guy. And Pepperidge Farm guy? She had cancer. She wanted her son to be with the natural father. Natural father? Well, his mate has no idea what is Look, going on. Look, I did it. Move, swoop, and pull. Oh. Why don't uh, temporarily I'll hang on to the kid until you find him a new family? Well, I don't know, man. So True. Yeah, kid sure will get attached. Where are we going now? Where are we going now? Hey, Dad, how's it going? How's Florida? Not too bad. Oh, his Mother dad's really rich. Complaint. Kind of adopted a kid. Kind of. You idiot. You better give that kid back. Why is it so idiotic to adopt a kid? For the past three days, he just never leaves me alone. You would think he wants some privacy, <laughs> but he doesn't. I'm in deep... <laughs> Put him in school, what about that? Yeah, no, I care about you saving money on this phone call. So aggressive. Let's eat. And the kid's just witnessing his aggression as well. I got a real dad and the guy's out of his mind. He's been telling me what to do my whole life. He never lets me figure stuff out on my own. It's because you're lazy, dad. dude. That's why, look at this guy over here. He's probably a nice little boy just like you. Then his dad messed his mind up. <laughs> up. Hey, you're mad at your dad, not at me. I forgive you. <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> Father. Oh, he yeah, was I right. Like I mean, why don't you pick your name? It's gonna be your name the rest of your life. What do you want it to be? Hey, that's not a bad idea. Frankenstein. Okay. Frankenstein? Uh, right, maybe not. Oh, he looks cool. Good luck walking down the street. That's all I can say. He's not the worst dad ever. Putting a lot of time with the kid. He just keeps feeding him crap, though. Where's the fruits and veg? Okay. Slide under. It's got a lock wrist. Oh, see, teaching him self-defense. Teaching him young, too. You'll be the only kid your age with a slingshot, I promise. The hell, he's wearing pants on his head. Daddy, daddy, come here. What is it? Come here. Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. What did he do? Oh, my God. Oh, Lord. He just killed all those pigeons. Oh, it's October time. Maybe the guy has no candy. Oh, don't rage. Oh, wow. How did he get in? Uh, yeah, that's it. Life and then CDs. Yeah, he's not happy. What else you got? He's robbing him. Thank you. Aw. Next year, be prepared, moron. That's not a good example. What do you want? 30 packets of ketchup. Ew. Packets of ketchup. Hey. Do that thing I taught you the other Is he other literally day. just having sauce? Oh, God. That is nasty. Get options instead of orders, you know? Let him make the right decision. He's not making great decisions, though. I want to go to school. Oh. Look at that. I don't force him. He makes the right decision. Wow. All right, let's do the thing again. Just using him for his own entertainment. Oh, God. How is that good? I'm sorry, but that's disgusting. That is sick. <laughs> is this another prank? This isn't a big problem. We'll hey. Just, um, we'll find your parents. It's Kevin's fiance's sister. Hey. Good job, buddy. 
Just peeing on his own. Pee in the toilet. No. Just pees outside all the time. Oh, she's licking me. He's licking my hand. You don't come over the Sunny's apartment tonight. There's a good chance that I'll develop a stutter. Oh, he's trained him well. So he's just going to date his roommate's fiance's sister. You forgot to say goodnight. Oh. They've been my favorite band since I was like 12. Oh. My friends make fun of me all the time too. I've seen them like 25 times. Wow. I already have a lot in common. I got to do the robot voice for Mr. Roboto. Really? Oh. Nah, I made that up. Uh -huh. So when they come to town, we get to go out to dinner with them and they tell us stories from the road, stuff like that. Really? Nah, I made that. <laughs> I, I figured so. <laughs> You're not uh, attracted to like 60 year old guys, are you? <laughs> yeah. So specific. It turned out they weren't carrots, they were peanuts. Oh. Peanuts? Just making up a story out of his bum. And the squirrel said, of course. And They're making up a story together. Very... And so was the squirrel. And the mm. rabbit thought that the squirrel had very pretty hair. Oh, it's about them. And the rabbit got shut down. Did he? <laughs> <laughs> Is the kid asleep? Time for her to go to her own home. I think that's probably for the best. It's your first day. Take it slow. Oh, school time. I don't like these kids. He hasn't even met them. Put them on if you feel scared, okay? Yeah, but no one else is going to treat uh -oh. him like he's invisible. I like your hat. Oh, he's already making a friend. I wonder if he'll miss Julian throughout the day. I think we may have found a family for Julian. Wow. Hello. You're a lawyer? What are you doing? Duke? Oh, wow. I even got to do my laundry on my lunch hour. Yeah, yeah, I know that place. Okay, well, maybe I'll see you there then. Or you could offer to do her laundry since you're doing nothing and could save us some time. She's less stressed. It's hard to know what's going down on the streets when you're in an office seven days a week. Seven days. That is rough. You know what else is good? Smoking dope. What? Oh, he's sussing out the kid. Are you kidding, though? These kids are five. We all love you who. Especially you who with a little rum. What's wrong? Why especially him? SpaghettiOs. You like SpaghettiOs? SpaghettiOs in a can. Vented cans at half price. Microsoft went down three points. Oh, my God. I'm going to spill one. Crack one open. Look at that. You guys wear the same size T-shirt. That's cool. Because uh, where I come from, it's called doing the hibbity dibbity. Oh, she's strong. Oh, so this is something you learned at Hooters. Oh, my God. He's so disrespectful. See you later, Frankenstein. Hey, you stay away from the frozen food section. Your boobs will harden. Rude. So rude. You got to respect the place where the fatter you are, the cooler you are. Hmm. <laughs> I was here, that guy was with a different girl, but I guess he ate her. Oh my god! <laughs> you picking your nose? He was picking his own all day, so I figured he could borrow mine. Because <laughs> I win. What's the name of that game, anyways? I win! He's a kid, I guess. Whatever. He's not playing with real money. You work all the time. I know, I'm really excited. Excited? About what? Working all the time. I guess, I guess I feel like I gotta kick ass while there's ass to be kicked. I like her. Day, but at night you have fun with Sonny. Doesn't he want to get like a real job to at least help with the kid for the meantime? Oh, <laughs> what the heck? This is Corinne's place. She is rich. Not your ass kid. I just kid. He's got to have more respect for Corinne now. So, now that he's dating her sister. Maybe we should try a kiss out. Just try it out. We'll see if any sparks fly. Oh, really? Give it a shot just so I can have some dignity at home. Damn, he's like begging. He's begging at this point. Oh my god. Gross. <laughs> this is embarrassing. Mouth out. He's dirty and he's poor. He's poor? Wow, ouch. You have a good sleep tonight there, Corinne. Pleasant Hooters. Yeah, I don't see that working out, given he's so rude to Corinne. Good one. That's a capitilla. A, a caterpillar. A caterpillar. Miss <laughs> Foot. Miss he Foot. Father? Yeah, how you doing? I'm Kevin Garrett. Identity theft is a real crime, okay? It's very serious. Identity theft is not a joke, Jim. Millions of families suffer every year. He spilled a tube of glue on the floor and didn't tell anybody. He just covered it with newspaper. Oh. Uh -huh. Our students wore rollerblades for show and tell, and Julian tripped him with a stick. Oh. I've never... I like him to feel like he can express himself freely. I've really never seen any problems with that. Now he's thing in class. 
Don't you see that this behavior is wrong? How's that got to do with hygiene, though? You should get him to stop and everywhere for a start. Wow, I didn't know this about George Washington. Now he's playing games. You'll play later. You can't tell me what to do. Okay, kid's getting rude now. <laughs> it's the kangaroo song again. He hasn't napped though. What do you say? This kid is becoming insolent. Hi, Julian. How you doing? Oh. I'm so I was wondering if maybe you could keep him company in the tub. <laughs> Cute. You Lola, study hard. sit. You have to be smart. I could be in the scuba squad. Uh oh. oh sure. And one more thing. Be nice to the delivery guy, would you? Oh. Not his fault. He can't read. Oh. Take care. <laughs> Talk to you about some secret mission or something. I have no idea what you're talking about. <gasps> How come I have to wear a bathing suit? I don't know. I don't know the rules oh. with little kids and grown Right, and yeah, yeah. Naked and just sit down. He's just trying to do the right thing. I respect well, that. Just, you know that uh, Benjamin Franklin invented bifocals? That's pretty cool, huh? There's He's teaching cool him. He's today. helping him help study. Can we still have fun? <laughs> yeah, we can have fun, but after you study. In fact, that sounds get fair. Dressing. After you get out, we'll go to Barney's. Barney? Not that Barney. Uh, Different Barney. Not Barney the dinosaur. <laughs> Oh, wow. Looks like he's going to the school disco. We used to have that in primary school. See? Urinals are good too. Oh, there you go. Oh, look at this. Oh, smart. Oh, portion control. That's it. Philadelphia. Oh, smart kid. I'm proud of him. He's come a long way. Yeah. Pony? Yes. He's learning too. Keep hop. Keep hop anonymous. Keep hop anonymous. You gave him the easy one. <laughs> uh, I don't think so. <laughs> oh, he didn't slow down. My name is Alexander Hamilton. Oh, I can't wait to see Julian. Oh, I can't wait. Oh my gosh! Inventor, an estate I wrote many books, invented many things we still use today. Wow, good job, kid. I'm so proud of him. They're all so cute and small. So what? Relax, kid. There should be same set of rules for everyone. I would agree. Hey, Mr. Brooks, how you doing? You just called me Mr. Koufax, though, didn't you? Ooh. What is your name? You fraudulently held yourself out to be Kevin Garrity. Yep. In custody for... I've delivered to you before. You always order three pieces of cheesecake. <gasps> the real Kevin Garrity called me up. He, he asked me to take care of the Save kid. Save it, Mr. Koufax. It seems so dodgy. Now. Julian, you're going to have to come with hey, me. Hey, 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 hey. Just give me... One second, pal. This is bad. This is very bad. Give me a second to say goodbye to the kid. He didn't think about the kid's emotions. Like, how would he feel once the truth came out? How long am I going away for? Kind of a long time. I screwed up, pal. I'm so sorry. This is what happens when you don't think things through. Please don't make me <laughs> He takes one look at him and he's like, no! I won't play the kangaroo song anymore. This is so sad. Damn. Not it. <laughs> I know. Oh damn, he's getting emotional. It's hard seeing Adam Sandler get emotional because we're just used to him in comical roles. This is a comedy movie, but this is goddamn sad. I filed a uh, brief to get custody based on the best interest of the child. Uh oh, this is exactly why I didn't want to get involved. Yeah, I had things going just the way I wanted. Yep, a kid showed up on my doorstep. You think I planned on that? Oh, yeah, but counter argument. I... So now my plans have changed. <sighs> Chillin' stuff. Very, very, very chillin' stuff. Representing the city of New York. Ted Castellucci. Honestly, he should just and get his roommate back. Kofa. Anyone else? Layla Maloney. Oh, she showed up. Wow. He's got a lot of lawyers on his side. Koufax is a good egg. He was nice to that kid. Oh. But he fights like a girl. 
You like that? Oh god. How's here. that relevant? What are you gonna do about it? <laughs> they shouldn't have used him as a witness. See, my dad was a military man. This I wasn't such a good soldier. <laughs> good pun. Well, I woke up, broke his arm, haven't seen him since. Okay, I don't know how this story is relevant. If OJ can get away with murder, why can't Sonny have his kid? Oh my god. This guy Lord. knows what I'm talking about. <gasps> no more questions. <gasps> this guy. I deliver food for six years. Oh, that's Plus a long time. Paper. Yes, considering we're in America. I mean, if you don't like spaghetti and meatballs, why don't you get the hell out? Damn, Damn dude. Why is he clipper? still here? Don't stop yelling at me! <laughs> Just leave the courtroom. Excuse me, am I in the right room? Oh my god, the so dad. Mr. Koufax appear to be an attentive and loving father. He certainly did. Oh, that's good. And for the record, where did you work while you attended medical school? Oh, why is this relevant? Can you tell me how old you are? Bring the glasses. Oh, that's so cute. And what's your birthday? <laughs> July 15th. Oh, he's a cancer. He taught me how to pee on a building. Oh, God. Most critics are cynical. <laughs> Told him a swear word. And if your mother could pick anyone in the world to be your new daddy, who do you think she'd pick? Sonny. Oh. But if Kevin actually is the real father, wouldn't he want to be a father to this kid? And which of your esteemed co-counsels would be examining you? My father, Lenny Colfax. Oh, what the hell? Is he a lawyer, dude? This court is after the truth, not the opinion of the defendant's father. You want my opinion? My son is a moron. I withdraw <laughs> my objection. Please proceed. <laughs> now that it benefits you guys. Objection! Shut up, Tommy. <sighs> Sorry, Mr. Colfax. <laughs> and of course, you are not Kevin Gaffney. No. So you're lying. Yes. That's really I bad. I and I want you to take her around, show her the city. And you said that you had better things to do, didn't you? Better you can't bring up the past, to... though. And what happened to your Aunt Faye that weekend? She died. Oof. She not looking very good for him. I went to Jones Beach, got drunk, and fell asleep. Hell yeah! <laughs> he is a drain on the economy, on the country, and most of all, on me! God damn. Hard dad. Anna, to give this... Young man, custody over another life is not only wrong, it's insane. I mean, I don't think you're a very good dad either, sir. I love you. What? You don't have to be scared, it's all right. Oh. I will not fail at that, I can't. I love this kid too much. Oh, dude. I love him, and I'm gonna give him advice, and I'm gonna guide him, and I'm gonna be there for him whenever he needs oh, me. Oh, dude. I'll fly to New York to be at his court case. Even if I disagree with why he's there in the first place. Oh. So don't be scared about me making money. I am in love with a beautiful girl who makes plenty of it. <laughs> She'll be my sugar mama. <laughs> I know this is the right thing to do, Dad, because oh. I would die for this kid just so he wouldn't have to feel one ounce of sadness. That is a good level of empathy coming from Sonny. Exactly. That was a really good speech. Of course, everyone's calling their dad now. <laughs> that when you're done <laughs> my son deserves this kid wow that's pretty big <laughs> that makes you granddad the fact is you kidnapped this that child. is also true Not we can't forget about that is that boy's father i refuse to press charges oh good finally speaking up i was so hammered that chicken wings and most in 3-0 you know, Canadian beers like moonshine. That's why he Hell didn't yeah. speak up. Because they were still right together at the time. Pending a blood test, I... Whatever. Pending a blood test, whatever. To Kevin Garrity, pending the results of a DNA test. Hey, I mean, it's still better. Kevin and Sonny are roommates. I can be your friend. No matter what. Mm, right. the Uncle Sonny. One of your things very easy. Loose whooping pole thing. I swear to God, it's working. Right. Trying to teach him how to father his own you know kid what? now. Oh, so sorry. weird. So oh. weird and awkward. Oh. Ouch. <laughs> you know what I got? I got some noisemakers. Check this out. I like Kevin as his dad. Oh, he doesn't have to destroy cans of SpaghettiOs. Just do this. Oh no, not a montage of all of their good times. Please, I just finished crying. One year, three months, and six days later. Okay, I want to get back to work. He passed his bar exam? Well, I'm working on a big case. I got a suit. Oh wow, he's getting his life together. Buddha's restaurant. Happy birthday, Sonny. Is he still with the girl? Don't waste a good surprise on me again. <laughs> 
<gasps> oh my gosh, do they have a baby together? Oh, they do have a baby together. What is he talking about, mommy? Oh, mommy. I got your clock radio. Clock radio, thanks for telling. Ruin the surprise. Hey, can we get some curly fries? Oh no, his ex working at Hooters. How ironic. I thought she had a good job. Oh my God, he works there as well. That's karma. That's the guy at the old boss. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy he got his life together. So I just finished watching two Adam Sandler movies tonight. One of them was Waterboy and then Big Daddy, which is what I am reviewing right now. I have to say, I probably enjoyed Waterboy more than Big Daddy just because I was expecting more laughs out of Big Daddy. I got a little bit emotional during Big Daddy. And Sonny Koufax kind of frustrated me a lot for the most part in the beginning of the film because you see him as this very irresponsible guy that doesn't really have his life together. Big Daddy follows the story of Sonny Koufax who adopts a child just to impress his girlfriend. That reason alone is just very morally questionable because you shouldn't adopt a kid just to impress someone, first of all. However, he spends a lot of time with the kid and he begins to form a really lovely bond with the kid and he learns the importance of responsibility and love which I can say is very admirable for a person like Sonny who barely had any sort of responsibility for himself even. He didn't really take care of himself before Sonny and he kind of didn't make all the right decisions for Sonny at the beginning of the film either. It is a good comedy though because it has a lot of heart. Adam Sandler's performance of Sonny is funny and it's endearing and the chemistry between him and the child actors that play Julian is just very, very sweet and very believable. So the child actors were Dylan and Cole Sprouse, and I thought that they did an incredible job playing Julian. Julian was just such a sweet and cute kid. You couldn't help but just instantly fall in love with him. The supporting cast as well, Joey Lauren Adams recently reacted to Chasing Amy, so it's good to see her again, as well as Jon Stewart. They were both really fantastic in their respective roles, and they definitely added to the movie's heart and the humor. This movie definitely tackles themes of change and growth, and we see that change and growth in Sonny. He was completely irresponsible before Julian. Julian comes into his life. He is probably still irresponsible for the most part, but as soon as Julian gets into school and he gets some feedback from Julian's teacher, I feel like he definitely changes his ways and he tries a lot to be a more responsible father. And this entire experience with Julian and going through the court as well, losing Julian, I think was a wake up call for him because a year and a bit later, he is in a relationship still with the same woman and he has a kid of his own and Julian is still in his life and he looks back at his relationship with Vanessa and he doesn't regret anything. He's happy where he is. So it was really lovely to see that character growth. If you were to tell me that would have been Sonny at the beginning of the film, I probably wouldn't have believed you because he was just so... He was just the complete opposite of who he turned out to be at the end. I think this is a pretty great lighthearted comedy. And even though it's emotional, it definitely knows how to lift your spirits back up at the end there. I thought it was a happy ending. It was the most realistic ending. Probably not realistic completely because Sonny didn't go to jail but the real father didn't press charges and that's probably what helped them there. But in reality, I think despite the fact that the real father didn't press charges, I still feel that at least in today's age, Sonny would have been arrested for kidnapping a kid. <laughs> Who knows? I don't know. I'm just guessing because that just didn't seem very believable to me, but it is a comedy and I enjoyed it. So let me know what you thought of Big Daddy in the comment section below. Let me know what your favorite Adam Sandler comedy is. So far, I would have to say, Billy Madison for me and Happy Gilmore. I've watched Happy Gilmore on my channel, Waterboy as well, and Big Daddy. And Happy Gilmore definitely supersedes for comedy and story. Really loved Happy Gilmore, but this was quite enjoyable too. So let me know your thoughts. Give this video a big old like if you enjoyed it. it really does help my channel out. And if you want to support me and watch the uncut version of this video with me over on Patreon, you can do so. I actually have a library full of movies that we can watch along together. You just need a copy of the movie. I can be on one screen. The movie can be on another screen. Patreon is also where you can find early access to my YouTube videos behind the scenes bloopers and polls down below you can also find all my social media handles as well instagram twitter twitch discord tiktok facebook 
as well as my two other channels my gaming channel cherry plays and my vlog channel very cherry so guys thank you so much for watching take care of yourselves and i'll see you in the next one bye everyone